Amid outrage over the death of Daniel Pru, the police department in Rochester, New York, will now have new leadership after the police chief and a deputy chief abruptly retired. Five other members of the command staff also either retired or were demoted. I can assure this community that I am committed to instituting the reforms necessary in our police department. The city's mayor insists she did not pressure Chief Laurent Singletary to step down, though she'd previously criticized him for initially not informing city officials of the use of force during the encounter. In a written statement, he says the mischaracterization of the actions that I took after being informed of Mr. Prude's death is not based on facts and is not what I stand for. The announcement came on the same day Prude's sister, as executor of his estate, sued the city and some members of the police department, claiming Prude died from unlawful force and a deliberate disregard for his medical needs. Get on the ground. Police videos released by Prude's family back. last Don't week move. show the deadly Don't encounter. Move. Back in Don't March, right officers here. found Don't Prude move. naked in the middle of the street and placed him in what's known as a spit hood because they say Prude told them he had COVID-19. At one point, he stopped breathing. Paramedics tried to revive him, but he died at the hospital days later. Last week, seven officers were suspended with pay, and days ago, the chief shrugged off a question about his possible resignation. Have you offered to resign? Did you resign? No, I know there was a rumor that I offered to resign. I, I did not. I'm still the chief, police chief today. Overnight, protesters painted Black Lives Matter on the street where Prude was detained. We would like to see everyone who was complicit in what happened with Daniel Prude held responsible. That means the police chief. That means the mayor. We'll be out here every night until all of those things happen. The mayor says the chief will stay on the job until the end of the month. No successor has been named. Meanwhile, New York's attorney general says that she will impanel a grand jury as part of the investigation into Prude's death. Craig. Gabe Gutierrez for us this morning. Gabe, thank you.